Okay, here's another DIY device. Air compressor is running. You see bubbles going here. Yeah, let me. I have a long painter's pole here. And what I'm doing is called an air lift vacuum. And many people know when you go to look for a vacuum for a pond, the ones you try to buy are just horrible. They don't really work. So this is simply a DIY device, like everything else I always do, that works to collect stones and stuff off the bottom because I have all these pots. And right now I got the fish are in there ripping the stones and everything out. And the problem is, is how do you get them all out? So, I'm doing this video here to show kind of how it works. As you see, the air is getting thrown up into a bag here. And this is just from air, pulling up a hose. And it's a lot of suction. Let me go over here and shut the pump off. This here, this bucket of rock and stone was taken from here the day before yesterday when I evaluated this to give it a whirl and see how it works. And let me show you how what this is. All it is, it's a long painter's pole. Just one-handed is difficult. So, painter's pole. Long painter's pole on the end. It's just I just took the piece of hose, which is the vacuum hose from this, and drilled a hole in the side and threaded in an air coupling. Obviously air rises in water, so it goes into the hose, flows up the hose, and then wants to come up the top. But check this out. This was two minutes. And look at this. A great big bag of gravel. Stuff I couldn't get out for the life of me. And this thing, there we go. Look at that. I mean there's Stones. There's two-inch river rock that was in there that this thing was able to lift, airlift. And look at this. It's just a cheapo five-gallon pump. Goes out at about 100 psi, but not while it's running. You're getting maybe 20 psi, maybe while it's flowing. So all these vacuums that people buy for ponds that try to pull up the deep can't even pull up simple pieces of leaves or whatever. This thing just pulls everything off the bottom. Uh, and right now, because this is just a standard, it's like a screen mesh, mesh door, but it's very thick. Uh, any other material like soot or anything that's sitting on the bottom, it's going to cloud up your pond until you get it, it runs through your filtration system. But I mean, in the grand scheme of things, this is an amazing vacuum. As you see, Anybody have any questions? Let me know. Thank you.